A major honor tonight for the outgoing president of Miami-Dade College, Dr. Eduardo Padron, is stepping down after 50 years as an educator and college leader. But even after he steps down, his name will live on at Miami-Dade College. <laughs> It was a celebratory mood at Miami-Dade College as administrators, alumni, and local elected officials gathered for a renaming and rededication ceremony. I'm not sure I can handle all this. The man of the hour, Dr. Eduardo Padron, who is stepping down as president in August. The Board of Trustees is seeing him away by renaming the Inner American Campus in Little Havana, which Padron helped create back in the 1970s. It is now the Eduardo J. Padron Campus, the nation's largest bilingual higher education center. Uh, this moment is really humbling and uh, very moving for me. The emotions that I feel are hard to put into words. Padron has spent his professional life at Miami-Dade, starting as a professor in 1970 and serving as president for a quarter century. Along the way, he's received countless tributes, including a Presidential Medal of Freedom from President Barack Obama. Padron proudly accepting the honor while never forgetting he came to the U.S. from Cuba alone at age 15. It's a day that we commemorate the legacy of a great man, Eduardo Padron. We do it in so many different ways today by naming this building after him, by creating a scholarship fund, making it uh, a day in the city and the county. Transformed this uh, institution. It's now nationally recognized. Hundreds of thousands of residents from Miami-Dade County. They owe really a lot of their success to Miami-Dade College. Padron led Miami-Dade to national recognition, but he believes his greatest achievement was to make a college education and all the benefits it brings a reality for everyone. It's really the most democratic of all institutions in our community. It's the open door to opportunity. It's a great equalizer that gives everyone a chance. It's a way to get the key to a better life. Under Dr. Padron's leadership, Miami-Dade College graduated more minority students than any other institution of higher learning in the country.